Hey, this is Aaron. And Blake, we're AB Data. Thanks for watching our Ultric Tool demonstration videos. Today we're taking a look at the Multi Field Formula Tool. The uh, Multi Field Formula Tool is a uh, blue preparation tool. Let's just go ahead and delete these old examples out so we can complete it ourselves. So it's a blue preparation tool. It can be uh, found with other tools like the formula. Uh, we're going to be looking at the example that is provided with the tool today, like we always do in these videos. The first thing that we're going to do is we are going to apply an expression to a field of one type and create new fields. So in this case, we are going to look at our text fields, and we are going to create new fields that are all uppercase versions of what we already have. So we want to make sure that our box is checked to say that we're going to copy out foot fields and add. We're going to have a prefix that is new underscore. We're going to go to our function section here and look at string functions and grab the uppercase function. And then we're going to put the current field in here for the field, which is going to say any of these five. So it's going to look at these one at a time. It's going to make it uppercase and then create a new field that's going to be called new underscore and then the original name we're going to go from having 18 fields to having 23 because we have created five new fields now we're going to do the same thing only we're going to use a suffix so it's going to look the same we're just going to have the original field name and then underscore new signifying this is a new one let's go ahead and copy this tool and paste it down below to do the same thing but without creating new fields for each one. So the only thing that we're going to change here is we're going to uncheck the copy output fields and add box. We are going to go ahead and hit the run button. And now you'll see that the name, address, city, and state fields all have been made uppercase, whereas before they were a mixture. Let's look at our last um, example here, where we are going to adjust the output field type and size. We're going to look at numeric fields and we're going to look at the fields that are sales from January uh, through December and then there's also a total field. We are going to copy the output fields and add and we're going to say percent total as a suffix on each of these months except for total because we don't want or need the total that's going to be a hundred percent. We are going to change the output type here to a um, to a fixed decimal. So we're going to uh, have a size of 4.1. Since this is a percentage, we won't have anything over uh, 100%. And we won't even have that really. So we're going to say our current field divided by our total field. And then we're going to multiply that by 100 in order to make it a percentage. Let's go ahead and hit the run button and look at our new fields off to the right. Now we have 30 fields because we've had 12 new ones added. And it's each month's percent of the total. So we took our month, put it over our total, and created this new field called percent of total. Thank you for learning with us today. Good luck on your Alteryx journey. For more information on custom training, managed service automations, and more, please visit our website at abdataconsulting.com.